to all the users of ChatWM, this is it, right? This is what I'm working on all the time. So if you ask for a NeoFetch, it'll tell you that the DE is ChatWM. The thing is, I've been using my own ChatWM, my own version. And you see here Discord, which at this point in time was still have to wait for an update since I do not maintain it anymore, right? You have to figure it out, made tutorials about it anyway. So go check on YouTube. I'm just waiting and sitting it out. We have Firefox here. We have here our little Brave icon, Opera, not by default there, but in my case, yes, Minstick, Pulse Audio, Telegram and Vivaldi. So there are two extra, Brave and Opera that are not on the default. On the, you know what I'm gonna say, on the GitHub, maybe we should start with adding this by default, right? Saying, okay, next time around, you start up and have those two already there, use current pages, voila. So these days I'm no longer a developer, I'm a user and I'm explaining you that we have new candy icons, that's previous video. And in this video, I'm gonna say, I have my personal Arclis chat WL on my own GitHub. So if, and that's a big if, right? I forked it from Arclis chat WM, never gonna change, that stopped, but you can use reuse, change the things we've built, all right? So this is where was the source. Make sure you signed in, that there is this personal icon and picture of yourself up there to the right. And then you can click on fork and suddenly you have on your own repo, the copy, basically a copy paste and then you change a few files. The files are here, setup edu, right? So specialized for me, Eric Dubois, edu, everything references to edu from now on. And you have to set everything with your account, of course. So that's the setup and that's the push to the internet, up to the internet, right? And I've done one push, well, 99 commits, but yeah, right? So I guess started here somewhere, my own config update and it's made changes to this particular setup, which is my setup. This is what you're looking at, right? It's also set to be Azerti. Ah, finally, right? Out of the box, finally, I have Azerti. Normally I would put everything into QWERTY and it's up to me to change it. Now it's the other way around. I use Azerti, so straight out of the box, I'll have an Azerti setup. So that's something you can um, install. This, what I'm gonna explain you now, is basically what um, can be applied for anything. If you want to add, if you want to add somebody's repo, anybody's repo, you have to read about it and you have to say, how do I need to do that? Add Nemesis repo. And basically that's it. Control C and copy paste. Where should it go to? It should go to computer file system, etc, pacman.conf, small c, enter, right? Sublime text for me is a great win. I set it, well, if I wanna read it to Perl, right? So I see all that's gray, it's not used and all that's colorful is used. So this is it, exactly the same, right? Compare the two. What I've done is add never, I'm gonna change that as well to the GitHub, that's true. It used to be package required database never, meaning it's signed. Why would I bother with signing if it's something for me alone? It makes things more complex, the keys will fail. So there are no keys, there are no issues. We're just gonna say never. And yes, I am the only one in control of that particular repo, right? I'm setting it before Chaotic AOR because if there is something 
let's say fast fetch is not okay. Fast fetch is coming from Kedok AOR. If I like to change or put a new version of fast fetch, I'll put it here. I update, Pacman will look from top to bottom and find an update here and install my version, not Kedok AOR version. That's always top down, right? So that's why Nemesis repo is before Celtic War, not using any of, any of these. So basically they can just go that they're there for maybe, right? Maybe I need something from there and just grab it quickly. Voila, that's it. If that's done, right? If you have access to the Nemesis repo, then you can do anything. Anything that's in here that I update is going to be here. And as you can see, there's already some of the packages that I, I miss on KOR, which is the Arc GTK theme, Arch Linux Logout, Arc Tone is my coloring system. So basically an Arc theme with a little bit less blue in it. Arc KDE, ChatWM, that's the one, right? That's the new version, that's this version that you can install and use plasma key bindings, plasma service menu. So the Arco Plasma has our uh, key bindings and the service menu is right mouse click in uh, Dolphin. Rofi needed to be there because of ZWM, right? SDM simplicity, we love it. Variety config, we love it as well. Arconet XFCE, CK Bay. So course air keyboard next for the coloring system. Didn't have that. Old, all old stuff and the grubs things. I've deleted all the grub things, so this is one that I forgot. I don't intend to use grub anymore. I'll use system D boot from now on. And all of these, right? Even Pamac is here. The new Neo Candy icons, Pamac AOR, Rofi. We needed this, right? Super D, that's Rofi. Spark lines, yeah, why not, right? Surfing icons, etc. And weather, small thing to know what weather it is. That's it. That's what I need from the Nemesis. Well, I'll probably put more things on it in the future, but we're limited to the ones under 100 megabyte, right? Yeah. That's what's allowed on GitHub. All over that is LFS is bigger. So we're gonna stick to the ones that are smaller under 100 megabytes limit. So that's um, another factor, not a news factor. If you like to follow me with ChatWM, you can now, and all the other packages as well, of course. So sudo pacman minus s, and this is it. This is all coming from, let's do this one, right? Because I don't want to mess up my own <laughs> setup now. Nemesis repo. Can't come from Arclex. Can't. There is no repo available, right? Nemesis repo, KL2K War. There is no Arclex repo. And this may be something um, how to, to proceed for the future as a user. Just giving you the ideas and the work has been done. You can use a Nemesis repo and install updates from any of these guys. Once they come along, I'll build them for myself. So you can add Nemesis and have that as well. All right, cheers.